Hey guys, it is Kid and Warrior Meow here today, and today we are going to be putting toys in houses and just decorating Fruit Loops' new second story house. So let's jump right into it. The first thing I did was take the wheel. With and I'm going to put it right, that makes a lot of noise, right here. Okay. The next thing I wanted to put in, I thought would be a pretty cute idea. So I'm going to put that right in the corner. The next thing I'm going to put in is this little bridge. I'll put that right there next to the little tube. I stopped recording for a little bit because my iPad died, but Fruit Loop came up here. Well, I brought him up here, and then he went down, and he kept going back down and up. So I decided to keep recording this. Anyway, I just put a salad bowl there while I was gone. That's all I really did. The next thing we're going to put in is this little reptile like hiding spot. And we're going to put it right here. Fruit Loop, can you move? Okay, I'll, I'll do that in a second, I guess. There, I just put that in. And now the next thing that we are going to be putting in is this. He also has one in his cage. Well, they're both his cage. Uh, they come in two packs. And this is one of my favorite chew toys that any of my hamsters have. Any of my hamsters have ever had. And we're just going to put that right here. The last toy we're going to put in his cage is just this little strawberry. I'm trying to go for a little bit of a natural look. Not too much, though. And we'll just put that right here. The last thing I'm going to do is just to sprinkle some of his bedding and confetti into here. I thought this looked kind of nice. And that's why. Just a little bit of his bedding because he can go back to his cage whenever he wants. It's not like this is a full-time cage now. Anyways, thank you so much for watching and bye!